In this video, I will talk about how to graph an equation by plotting points. When we graph an equation, uh, we don't know what exactly the shape of the graph is. A very common way is find a lot of points on the graph and put it on a coordinate plane, and hopefully we can find a pattern of the graph. This way is called graphing an equation by plotting points. For example, I want to graph the equation y equals x plus 1. First, we want to find some points on this equation. Uh, in other words, ordered pairs like x, y. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to just randomly find some x value and then use calculation to find the corresponding y values. So the x values I'm going to uh, put will be, let's say, negative 2, negative 1, 0, 1, 2. Some random numbers. Okay, so we can use the x value to find the corresponding y value. Okay, so when x equals negative 2, or when the input is negative 2, your output is negative 2 plus 1, right, which is negative 1. So your first order pair is negative 2, negative 1. That's one point on the graph. Okay, let's finish this whole chart. When your input is negative 1, your output should be negative 1 plus 1, right? So negative 1 plus 1 will give you 0. So the other or another point on the graph is negative 1, 0. Keep going. And here is 0 plus 1, which is 1. So 0, 1 is the next point. 1 plus 1 is 2. So 1, 2 is another point. 2 plus 1 is 3. So you have 2, 3 as the next point. So now we have 5 points on this graph of this equation. Let's plot the points into this coordinate plane. Okay, so here I have a coordinate plane with x-axis and y-axis. Now let's first plot the first point, negative 2, negative 1. So x is negative 2, y is negative 1, which is right here. x is negative 2, y is negative 1. First point. Second point, negative 1, 0. So negative 1, 0 is right here. Third point, 0, 1. 0, 1 is right here. Now next point, 1, 2. 1, 2, right here. 2, 3, similarly, it's right here. We can kind of see the pattern of this equation. It's going to be a straight line. Right, so I'm going to connect all the points over here, and the graph of this equation is a line. And this is the end of this video, and I will see you in the next video.